congratulations on the film. Thank it's you very much. so fantastic. How exciting is it to be here at the premiere to share it with everyone? Oh, it's wonderful. It's great. I mean, I love it. I mean, I've been kind of, you know, I mean, I'm a jobbing out. I've just left set and I've come here and made sure the babysitter's got the kids and they're all right. You know, it's fun. It's 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 a good laugh and I, I love it. But um, yeah, it's exciting. It might be a good laugh now, but when you were filming, you went through a lot. What was the most difficult part of shooting for you? Well, there was a sequence, I don't know if I can tell you this, in, in, in a, a tank with me and Charlize in a tank. And they, all, they went through an incredible safety procedure with us where they gave us this oxygen and then they said, you're going to go underwater and you're going to, and that's fine. And we did it in the rehearsal and I, and I was great. And I thought, I've got this down. Then the next day we filmed it and I forgot that I had a load of dialogue to say before. So I said all this dialogue and then never held my breath. So when I was under, I had no breath. And it was, and it was a long time. And the panic that sits in when you realize I can't move. I'm in, I'm in a car underwater and I can't move and I can't breathe. And then, uh, then they brought us back up, and uh, and that happens quite. A lot. I think that happened to Charlie's as well, where you suddenly panic, and then you get used to it, and then by the end of it, you you get into this kind of meditative state, and you could be down there for ten minutes, you're fine. But at first, it was terrifying. What is Charlie's there in like as an acting partner? Um, well, she. I mean, to, I mean, I've got one. She has to stop giggling, really, because we were so we were being battered by cars and she was fighting left, right, and center. And I think in order to let off steam, she likes a laugh. She likes a giggle. So we had a giggle. She's a great girl. I mean, I, you know, there's lots of big movie stars, and I've worked with loads of them, who can appear to be the nicest pe person on earth, but they're full of insecurities, and they cannot be nice people on set. She's the complete opposite. She's wonderful on set. This is a very, this filmmaking is a collaborative art form, and never more so than in this film. And she was fantastic. She led a great company. When you've got a female James Bond, yeah. what do you think that means? Why is this the right time for this action hero? Well, I think it's because the world is getting smaller, you know? Um, preconceived ideas about women, about minorities, about people with a different sexuality. When we thought that these things were further away from us, then we could generalize about them, but we can't anymore. You can't generalize about women because women are now more emancipated than they were before. People with people of uh, different sexuality now we now we have to accept them and we realize that they're just us. People of different color, and so all these preconceived ideas are challenged. And this film challenges one of those ideas: is that women can't kick ass because they can. Yes, they can. Thank you so much, Eddie. Congratulations on the movie.